Hey, what's up, beautiful people? Today is August 10th, and here's your daily energy report. We have a lot of quincunx energy today. It's uh, this yod that I spoke about yesterday is going to be lasting a few more days, and this is really, really hitting home. Quincunx energy is, it, it, it's not necessarily good or bad, but you can't touch it, right? So when you can't figure it out, and you have this feeling going through you and you're like, oh, I just, I can't, I, I don't know what to do with this. And the lesson or the point at which these two quincuxes come to is pointing to the sun. And the sun in Leo is all about leadership, stepping up into our responsibility. So what are you going to choose to do? Are you going to choose just to let go and say, fuck it and just have fun and let your responsibilities go to the, go to the wayside? Um, or are you going to realize what your greater purpose is in this world? See, there's two different ways that we can approach this energy happening in the world. We can just say, you know what? I don't want to deal with the world. It sucks. All this shit going on. It just, it's all so negative. I'm just going to avoid it. I'm going to just pretend like everything's okay and hopefully everything will be okay. But that's not how it works. Or... You can dig deeper and, 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 and feel into your purpose. Like, okay, I realize that there is a major mission for me or everybody on the earth right now, and I need to do something about it. I need to step up into my responsibility and make shit happen. Now, we also have Mars, of course, almost, uh, it's just one degree away from being square to Pluto. Now, this energy is gonna be going on for the next few months. Um, the, last, uh, the last of three squares will be happening on December 21st, right when, right at the same time that Jupiter and Saturn are conjunct in Aquarius. So this energy, it's bringing stuff up. It's not going away. It's actually starting a phase. And this is a phase mixed up with many other phases. And this is, this is warlike energy, okay? This is, you're stepping into your purpose and you're facing head on this challenge that your soul is stepping into to rise to this next level, right? For the purpose of humanity, guys, we all, we, I mean, my, my opinion, okay? We all need to step into this. If we don't, the world is fucked. It's completely fucked. So, you know, I really highly encourage you guys, um, because before we know it, coming up the next few months, if we just try to pretend like everything is okay or we don't want to deal with the worldly stuff, we're going to get smacked real fucking hard in the face with life when they start putting these restrictions on us. And suddenly they start sending people to these, who, who knows what plans they have right now it's right now it's all hearsay and conjecture okay but i will say that we have to be smart and we have to be precise and we have to be dedicated to stepping forward into the responsibility of our lives okay see a lot of people you know just just trying to pretend like like the world is just normal okay and whatever normal is to you that's cool and, you know, I have a certain way about me where I'm super passionate, passionate about what I do. And of course, I do astrology. I see what's coming. Okay. And because I see what's coming, I'm preparing. I'm putting in that work. I'm making things happen so that we can step into this next level prepared and making sure that we go into this, this golden age that is most definitely coming, but it's our choice. If you're, if you're not doing the work and if you're not being deliberate every single day, you might get caught up in that other side. Man, I feel, I feel for you, okay? We also have the moon that's gonna be conjuncting Uranus today in Taurus. Now the moon is exalted in Taurus. That means we're gonna be emotionally strong, but it's gonna bring unexpected stuff coming up, okay? And you know, Uranus is still square to, uh, to the sun. It's at an eight degree orb, so it's not super, super hardcore right now. Uh, it's also square to Mercury still. So a lot of this like, we're navigating through these energies that we have to feel we cannot analyze. There's no analysis going on right now. But I will say with the sextile between uh, Jupiter and Neptune, 
um, this is giving us an opportunity to tap into some deeper gifts, some, some, some really powerful spiritual gifts, bringing those subconscious energies into the conscious mind. All right. And uh, we now have the North Node and South Node at 27 degrees. So it's moving right along. And now destiny, the world, the energy is speeding up. Watch, guys. Uh, you know, these energies are going to feel like they're going faster and faster and faster. Things are happening in the world. And we have, to be, we, we have to be prepared. We have to be ready. And we have to step into our responsibility. This time now, more than ever, okay? There's going to be many more uh, quincunx-like energies throughout this month in the midst of this Lionsgate portal. It's saying, okay, we need to go through this new door. This new door is this portal. In order to do it, though, all this baggage from behind, we have to deliberately say goodbye to it, to our old self. And if you're just distracting your life or pretending like everything's okay, then you're really standing at this door like with, you know, deer in the headlights look. You don't know what to do because you don't want to let go of what you're holding on to from the past. So think about this, let it swirl around your mind, okay? It's time to step into your, to your responsibility to this higher vibration, okay? And the universe is going to make it very difficult not to do that. All right, so uh, I hope you like this message. If you do, please share. Um, please let everybody else know. If you would like a reading from me, please go to spiritualbodybuilder.com or you can click the link in the bio or in the description box below on YouTube, all right? I love you guys very much. And uh, tune in tonight at 6 p.m. Pacific, uh, 8 p.m. Central, and 9 p.m. Eastern for our live health and wealth chat with Julie Murphy, my, my uh, wealth mentor and coach. Uh, I will see you guys there. Ask questions, check it out. And I uh, love you guys very much, and I'll see you tonight.